Hola gang, I am over here at McDonald's to try the CDC Poop Burger, better known as the Quarter Pounder, with cheese. Yeah! Welcome back to Old Nerd Reviews. I'm Tony, your old nerd of the day, and I do try things so you don't have to. So yeah, after Trump went and did his little silly, goofy thing at McDonald's as his way of jabbing Harris, where he was serving people at the window, immediately afterwards, I think it was only a day, the CDC put out a, an emergency statement that McDonald's quarter pounders were, were dealing with E. coli problems. Why only the quarter pounders? Why pick on the poor quarter pounders? Why not the, I mean, aren't they basically the same meat and stuff? Anyway, so we all know how reliable and trustworthy and honest the CDC is. Not. So I am here to put this wicked rumor to rest or die trying. Handy dandy steering wheel tray there to keep everything in its place and off my lap. You can believe that one. There's the bag it comes in. McDonald's there. McDonald's there. I wish they would add more personality back into all the McDonald's stuff. It's just so plain. There's the damage on the front. I had to grab myself my own napkins because on to-go orders, they usually don't add napkins. Why? I don't know. And oh, there it is, the quarter pounder. Now the CDC said just the quarter pounder, not the one with cheese, but I wanted cheese on there. So so maybe, maybe the cheese will protect me from the E. coli. So yeah, um, not very big looking. Anyway, um, I'll get in here for a look. And there's the quarter pounder with cheese. Love the bun, love sesame seed buns. So there we go inside. You see the pickles, the onions, the cheese, ketchup there, and uh, the patty. And supposedly, I think that's all that's in it. There wasn't a description on the, um, on the app, so yeah. But that looks pretty choice. So yeah, CDC, I think the timing on this supposed E. coli outbreak on the quarter pounder is a little sus. There you go, last look at the quarter pounder with cheese. Looks pretty good. So it looks like there's two layers of cheese on this thing, yeah. So it's a pretty good burger. The um, presentation is nice. All right, well, there we go. We're gonna take a big bite of the E. coli. Here we go. Here's a look inside at those patties and all the stuff. Do it again. Not a fan of those pickles. Any pickles. I like sweet pickles. But nobody seems to put sweet pickles on burgers. They always put dill pickles. What's up with that? I wouldn't like grilled onions on this better. Grilled onions are just best. Just are. Nice crunch to them though. Just eating that E. coli makes me happy. All right, so the damage on a quarter pounder with cheese from McDonald's. Oh, I got straw thing. Oh yeah, I forgot to tell you. Got myself a fabulous cola, Coke specifically from McDonald's. McDonald's makes the best because of the process of that that um, metal um, containers, the metal containers that they use. Are they stainless steel? Something like that, but the way they do them just makes it better than every place else. And hey McDonald's, where's my regular cups? I don't want these plastic ones, I want the regular white ones. Wait, 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 wait. isn't plastic bad for the environment? Oh, oh, that's right, that was last week. Well, maybe next week, right? All right, back to the damage. The damage on this thing was a whopping, whopping, I'm going through puberty again, still doing, getting over the voice thing, $5.49. 
that's expensive. Once again, it's real lucky that I'm not factoring that in to my, um, to, um, my, um, yeah, what, what the thing, my rating, that's it. That's what I want to say, my rating. All right, let's break it down. The bun is nice. Sesame seed buns are great. Uh, it's fresh tasting, which is good. Um, slightly toasted. The double cheese is nice. Everything cheesy is great. Um, although it could have been a little bit more melted for me. Uh, the onions are nice. They're nice and crunchy, nice crisp onions. Um, although, like I said, I would have liked grilled um, the mustard, the, the ketchup on those things, you know, it is what it is. Uh, the pickles had a nice little crunch to them, although I'm not a fan. Um, and the burger patties, um, do they come, does it come with two? No, it just comes with one. So the burger patty, singular, uh, was nice. Uh, slightly seasoned and uh, decent. So all around a pretty nice burger and a very nice presentation. Minus the E. coli, of course, right? That that shouldn't be an added thing. Just keep that off my burger. All right, on the Nerdometer, um, I would give the Quarter Pounder with cheese. Um, I think I would give this a middle of the road. I like it. It's a pretty good burger. Good presentation, everything was flavorful, everything was on there, and um, yeah, price sucks, but it is what it is. But if I don't come back, if you don't see me again, you'll know the E. coli got me and the CDC was telling the truth. Don't count on it. There you go, gang, another, re another review in the bag. Thanks so much for being here. You guys have a freaking awesome day and i'll talk to you again bye now